Well, like I said, you you've done more than enough and answered more than enough questions. I know you're a busy man, you guys. Uh, well, I know you posted a picture of your thumb, uh, freaking almost bleeding from playing Madden 17. So I don't want to hold you. Um, I do want to say I truly, truly appreciate you taking the time to you know you really humbled me to actually do this interview. Uh, I also want to say thank you to Symbol Critic for allowing my name to be uh, not muted in his uh, video with you when he had you at E3 because uh, I don't know if you're aware but a lot of people don't, um, well I don't get along with a lot of untrustworthy and uh, specific people in the Madden community that do the wrong thing and also I also don't involve myself in wages or coin selling but you already know that you're a mod in my stream so that part is not an issue and I respect all you guys terms of agreement and all that stuff like that so um, just want to thank you for taking the time out of your busy schedule to to uh, you know, sit down with Gmaya and go over some of these things. It's it's very very greatly appreciated. And as my channel grows, um, you know, the door is open for you to you know to tell me whenever you want to have something addressed and to have it released to you know my fan base because my fan base is completely different than anybody else's fan base in Madden, in gaming, in anything. They're they're the most loyal and ridiculous people you'll ever meet. But they'll they'll back and they'll respect you know what I tell them to back and respect and they support me. And that's why, um, you know, like I said, for you to do this, um, it, it's, it's unbelievable. I don't know how I could ever repay you, uh, but maybe sometime in the future I will be able to. So I just wanted to say thank you, Rex, for doing that for me. It's definitely appreciated. Oh, thank you so much for saying that. That means a lot. Um, what you can do to thank me is just keep, uh, you know, keep getting out there and promoting Madden. Like, like the more your channel grows, the better it is for Madden. And I, I'd love to see you and, and, and guys like you, uh, you know, Golden Sports, Gaming Powerhouse, Problem, Mo, uh, you know, T-Raw, like all these guys in the community who really put that time in. You mean Seattle, but like guys who really just put the hours in, stream Madden, uh, you're doing us a huge favor and we really appreciate it. So thank you to you for taking time out of your lives to play this game and stream it and promote it. If, okay, if one I last can, question. Go ahead, Mr. Byron. If end I can it. ask one last question, is there any way with all the great things that you're doing for Madden 17 that you can undo all of that so he'll hate the game and spend more time with me? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, but wait, I, I got one comment. And this goes back to your earlier point about you know, looking at a 99 OBJ card while your wife's half naked sitting in the room. Um, I'm an old man. I've been in this industry for 20 something years. You know, I've been playing games since the Nintendo NES, since the Atari days, to be honest. That's how old I am. I have never once in my life. For a minute, you should be. <laughs> well, you know, right now, like I said, I'm not going to actually stop to do it, but she knows she'll get it later. But it's just the fact that she wants to know that my focus is solely right now on the creative director of Madden 17 and that's you that's just my focus she she understands that she knows I'm a man of complete focus so like I said um, and also I, I just wanted to end with this though is there any way that um, I could possibly set up an interview with Mutt Guru to talk about the dangers of coin selling and things like that because as you know I have commands in my stream that tell people not to do it, not to promote it for, you know, getting scammed and stuff like that. And, you know, my background in this Madden community, I've always been a voice of security and trying to make sure that, you know, younger kids are, are protected. Um, and I saw that Muck Guru was very upset about specific people, I don't want to name names, uh, promoting coin selling, uh, different things like that, that kind of drive down the prices of Mutt and things like that. Is there any way that I'd be able to, if you could pull your strings for me to have a uh, conversation with Muck Guru? Does he follow you? I have. I, I don't know. I, I'm not sure. Yeah, I'll talk to him. Okay, because I, I just want to be able to make people understand because no matter what anybody says about Jemaya, they have to understand something. The number one priority is always safety and security for the kids because I get numerous private messages about guys getting scammed and stuff like that, and I can't do everything for everybody because it's too much. So. You know, as far as people with these coin selling sites, because me personally, my wife will tell you, my Facebook, Gmaya's World Facebook, I get flooded with private messages from all these coin selling sites. And that's been going on for the last two years. And I've never accepted any of it because I know that that takes away from EA Sports and what you guys do. Speaking of, you know, your upper executives and stuff like that, you know, the, 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 the priority is always the same for all of us. You guys want to make sure that things are done in the best business-like manner as possible. But as far as my content, 
I'm gonna always give you honesty and I'm sure that we can meet some place in the middle of that where we can all be happy with it and enjoy it, throw back a couple of shots and understand that nothing that I'm saying is done with animosity. It's all love for what you guys do and everything that you put into it. So I just wanted to make sure that that was clear with you so you, you heard it from me directly. Well, that's good of you to say. You know, outside of the business, um, I know it's not going to matter to most Madden gamers, but um, the thing that I caution everybody on, and they're really only strict about the coin selling stuff that's going on, um, is you don't want a console ban. A console ban is not something you want in your life. <laughs> uh, I would just say that straight up. Um, don't mess with it. I think most of the, the, the bigger guys in the community have learned um, by now, but you do not. It's not worth it. It's not worth it to never be able to log in to an EA server ever again <laughs> from your, your Xbox or your Facebook. Just don't, it's not worth oh, okay. it. Yeah, well. and for, and by the way, if, if you ever get hit up by a coin selling site and you wanna you know, make the place better for the community, just tweet it to me. Uh, we have ways to go after them and shut them down. So if you get contacted by one and, and you want to help put an end to it, tweet it to me or any one of the Madden guys and we'll take it. Okay, well, like, like I said, you could have all of them. I'll just go back and copy them and send them to you from Facebook. I, yeah, yeah, I'll, sh I'll send them to you. That's not a problem. Um, yeah, like I said, regardless of what, what like, like I said, with that part, I obviously don't want a console ban, but I just don't get involved with it because I know pretty much I try to stay uh, in the sp you know black and white area. I don't want to be in the gray and make people think I'm doing both sides. That's why I stay uh, straight and narrow. Regardless if other guys don't like you know other Madden commentators, whatever I've had problems with in the past. As far as my foundation, my foundation as far as what I stand for is clear and concise. If I don't like stuff that's going on with EA as far as the gameplay, I voice it, but I never go and do things that are against whatever they're promoting. So that's that's always from the beginning. So that. I'm going to make sure, I'll just send you the copies of, uh, well, snapshots of it, and you can do whatever you got to do with that. I'll send it to you privately on Twitter. You can handle that like that so that way you can know that um, it is what it is. So uh, I've held you long enough. Ms. Jima, you want to say bye to uh, Mr. Rex? Yeah, go ahead. Um, I want to say thank you and good night, Mr. Big Dixon. Okay, you didn't have to put big because oh. this is going on YouTube. You got it what? Is that okay? Uh, do I have to edit that out, Rex? What is this? What are you doing? No, you can leave that in. Thanks for watching. Madden 17 is in stores August 23rd, 2016. Be sure to go out there and get it. And once again, thank you so much, Rex Dixon. Nothing but love from G Myers World. One love.